Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get free outdoor color grading preset. This preset works both for Lightroom and Adobe Photoshop Camera Raw. Before heading to our website to show you how to easily download and use it on your images, let me show you something real quick. This was the before of this image and this is the after. You can see there are different layers that were created in order to achieve this amazing result. This image was retouched using the Slamming Retouching Pack. It's a retouching essential pack that comes with action that enhance, speed up, and ease your retouching workflow. If this is what you want, which also contains over 2,000 lots, presets, and Photoshop Camera Raw plugins, you can check the link in the description or check the link that will be showing at the top right corner of this video. With that said, let's head into our website and show you how to get this preset for free. Go on to your Chrome. Uh, if you don't know or if you need the link to this website, well, you can just head on to Google and search Slammy Photography. Slammy Photography. You write it as slammyphotography.com or just Slammy Photography. And then you see slammyphotography.com. If you click on the first link, it will take you to our website, uh, which is slammyphotography.com. And on this website, this is the home page. We are going to head on to the product page. If you the project page finish loading, it will bring you to this particular page here where you see our products. You can see if you scroll down here, you begin to see the free products and uh, above here, you see some uh, presets that we give at a very discounted price, $10 or so, uh, Slammy Magic Retouching Pack that we previously talked about. Uh, if you are finding it hard to get it from this website, you can chat with us on Instagram to get it right now. But that's not the main focus of this video. If you come down here, you see our free packs. You see this uh, Photoshop free glue and glamour skin tone lots, free realistic skin tone texture. And uh, at the time this video will be uploaded, you see another preset that will show down here that will contain the preset that I used for the image that you saw on the thumbnail. So if you click on the any of these free packages, to bring you to a page that is similar to this, you click on get package and you fill in the personal information, your full name, your email address. If you fill in your email address, we'll be able to send you other information like uh, when we put on, or when we put up another free preset, we'll send you a notification that, hey, we have put up a free preset. If we put up a YouTube video, tell you, hey, we have put up so-so YouTube video. Same goes with your phone number. You enter your country code, if you are in Nigeria, it's plus two, three, four. If you are in the US, it's plus one. Canada, plus one. And you know the particular country code for your own web um, country. So you put that in and then you add your phone number. And then you click on get now. If you impute your correct information, you see successful. You click on you can close this panel and click on the download button to begin download. So you click on OK and then you cancel this dialog to see the download button. So if you click on the download button, you see download link one, download link two, download link three, download link four. And you click on download link one. The other download link might take you to a different preset or a similar preset or even a YouTube video. But the download link one will surely take you to the exact <laughs> preset you saw on the uh, product image. So you click on download and then your image will automatically begin to download. Another thing I would like to show you in this video is how to load camera roll presets into your Photoshop. So if you come to filter, camera roll filter, you'll be brought into this camera roll program here. This available for all Photoshop CC version. And this camera roll 13 
it doesn't matter the version of camera you're using. But if you're using camera rotating, your interface will look exactly like this. Come to this three uh, button down here, more image settings, load settings. Go to the folder where you saved your particular preset and open it in on your image. You can see this exactly this particular preset. Obviously, you can go on and readjust if you like. But if it fits perfectly to your image, you click on OK and get into Photoshop. <laughs> right in Photoshop, if you think the effect is too much, you can come and reduce the opacity. And that is exactly how to use the preset. Uh, I've already applied this preset before, so you are seeing that it might have it might have adverse effect. If you want my full retouching course, write to me on Instagram and let's negotiate a fair price that you can get it. Anything you can afford. I promise to make it very easy for you to get because we are all creatives down here trying to make a living from photography, graphic design, and other creative endeavors. Like this video if you haven't already. Subscribe to this channel for more free tips, tricks, and photography tutorial. Happy to be part of your retouching journey. Bye, I'll see you in another amazing tutorial.